Life Size GT Award from Pink Water. On! Okay, we are fishing now at the FAD, okay, which is so a uh, fish aggregating device where most of the fish are gathered around the FAD and sometimes most of the pelagics are mostly gathered near the current head which is in front of the FAD. So when you cast near the front of the FAD, uh, it's actually casting against the current. So when I cast, I will normally will engage the gill and close my bill immediately so that, I, so that uh, I can control the line as it sinks. This is how it goes. Okay, close the line, we keep the stack line, okay, then we control the release. Okay, I always like to keep a very tight line between myself and the lure as it sinks, so that if along the way the fish takes, okay, I can strike immediately. Okay, we retrieve the lure fast with a bit of teaching action like this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. 
国や国や国国国国国国国国Let's see what size is this GT, yeah? Nice GT, man. All right, woohoo! Yeah, yeah, man. A nice size GT of off lumping water. This leo works perfectly, man, for such rough condition. Oh, I saw the boiler. I cast it over. First few can, I got it already. Excellent, man. Don't be shown. Alright man, finally man, a good size Spanish mackerel. I was uh, aiming a current hit, okay? Keep walking on the current hit and uh, 
finally managed to get a decent sized uh, Spanish mackerel. <coughs> I was um, twitching while I retrieve. I think it helps with this particular lure. When you twitch, the ducting action is very tight. And probably this what uh, excite this big mackerel. Yeah. <laughs> Okay guys, uh, it's the end of my fishing trip in Romping, casting, tough fishing, uh, weather is, rather, wasn't, wasn't on our side, we had strong wind, big wave and uh, we struggled a lot um, trying to find the fishes, uh, but eventually we still got some good fish, quite a few Spanish mackerel, big cobias, big queen, queen fish and nice GT to end the trip. A lot of sail follow the leo, um, but too bad no, we didn't have any luck with sail fish for this trip itself. Uh, for this trip itself, I'm using x red Magnum cast, okay, uh, it's 42 gram and um, this leo is very easy to cast, uh, even though with head wind, no, I still manage to keep good distance with this leo. Um, very easy to work, no, just con we can constant strip retrieve, we have a very tight um, swimming action, or you can twitch, when you twitch the leo, it darts left to right very vigorously, and the ducting action actually did excite, especially the Spanish macro for myself. Okay. However, one special, uh, one unique character about this leo is when you pause, it actually flutters. Okay, so um, I I landed the the cobia and uh, and, and the queenie when I pause, it flutters and it takes. So very interesting leo, and uh, I think it will be very exciting to try for other reef fishers or other pelagics for this uh, particular new leo that Apollo is coming out with. And for the rod I'm using, I'm actually using Monster P24. The reason why I use a slightly heavier rod is uh, it allows me to give, uh, give me a better casting distance with a heavier minnow and stiffer rod helps me work the lure where I twitch and you, if, you, if you see, I, I prefer to twitch when I cast my lure, when I, when I retrieve my lure this will give a very big uh, ducting action of the lure which actually do excite the fish That's, uh, it actually do excite the fish and it actually looks like an injured fish or a scared fish running away from the pelagic and the last thing for a stiffer rod, when the fish bite, it's easy for me to set the hook. Okay, um, so these are the two uh, main um, highlight of our uh, tackle I use for this trip. Hope you enjoy the video.